for Disease Control says that your hangover is costing the U.S. economy billions of dollars. According to a new report, excessive drinking cost the country $249 billion back in 2010. That's $2.05 per drink. That's up 11% from 2006. Items that go into this cost, health care, missing work, ambulance costs, bad productivity at work after a Mets game. Where can I keep going on? Anyway, the city that had the worst problem when it came to economic hits from um, binge drinking and hangovers. Don't tell me Chicago. No. <laughs> Better. Washington, D.C. Nice. <laughs> I don't blame them. They should get a pass. <laughs> so they just I mean, look at what the they have time. to deal with day in and day out. They have the cushiest jobs on the planet. Wow. They've got to work max 40 hours a week. That's they get so health care, retirement, n never get fired. I mean, this doesn't even t mention the toll that this takes on one's body, but why do, Why would I go there right now when my, people might be having a why hangover on after their <laughs> Thursday night? Let's talk Terrible. about binge drinking being a uh, stimulus for the economy. The amount of money that we spend on alcohol, much of it made here in the United States, and then all the excess food that you eat while you're drunk and the next morning when you're And the there drunk late night purchases online. We all, uh, we're nobody excellent, does that. Excellent point. Drinking, oh, drinking it online shopping. That's right. Yeah. How much spending have you done after midnight online? you got a big We've merger all done in it. the it brewing is. industry. Maybe there's a relationship It's there. the most fun thing and to do. And I mean, it doesn't <laughs> mention the people who are more productive when they're hungover. I mean, yeah. Drunk, drunk shopping. Drunk shopping. Drunk shopping. That exists, sweeping right? the nation. Never drunk shopped. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Cheryl, thank you for bringing that story to us you know, on this Friday No, that's morning. my job to bring the most important stories of the day to you, Sandra. That's a, that's a good one. <laughs> All right. Thank you.